the elephant that was hanged for being an elephant, the Spark Circus rolled into a dusty Tennessee town in 1916, its star attraction a magnificent elephant named Mary. But beneath the big top a tragedy was brewing. Mary's new handler a scrawny fellow named Red Eldridge with all the elephantine expertise of a broom salesman was woefully unprepared. Distracted by the sweet watermelon treat Mary strayed, Red, in a moment of boneheaded panic, lashed out with a metal hook. The pain erupted in Mary like a volcano. With a fury born of both confusion and agony, she snatched Red in her trunk, a fly swatting a gnat. The sickening thud of his body hitting the ground echoed through the stunned crowd. Pandemonium erupted, kill the beast, roared the mob, some even peppering Mary's thick hide with pistol fire, a pinprick against the fortress. The sparks circus their golden goose teetering on the edge, made a desperate decision. Public execution, a grotesque spectacle to appease the bloodlust and salvage their financial hide. Irwin, Tennessee, became the unlikely stage for this barbarity. A hulking crane, normally used for heavy lifting, was repurposed as a macabre gallows. The first attempt failed, the chain groaning in protest before snapping. This time, a thicker one, a symbol of their callous resolve was secured. The sickening creak of metal on bone marked the horrific end of Mary's life. The story of Mary is a stark reminder of the dark side of animal entertainment and a chilling example of mob mentality. It's a tragedy steeped in ignorance and cruelty, a stain on our past that should never be forgotten.